Iris found herself in the midst of an emotional maelstrom, torn between the love she harbored for her disabled military husband, Dave, and the unsettling suspicion that he might be entangled in an extramarital affair, the delicate balance she had maintained in their relationship, caring for Dave with unwavering dedication, seemed to unravel as peculiar behavior became a recurring pattern, Dave, confined to a wheelchair since his return from war, was the focal point of Iris's life, she dedicated herself to his well-being, finding gratification in the peaceful sight of him sleeping, yet, the equilibrium they had achieved faced a tumultuous shift when Dave's late-night excursions became a cause for concern, Iris grappled with her initial dismissals of his actions as mere idiosyncrasies, sensing an unsettling undercurrent that threatened to rupture the foundation of their marriage, the tipping point arrived when Dave, in his haste, left his phone behind, unwittingly opening a portal into a clandestine world of betrayal, Iris, confronting the ethical dilemma of invading her husband's privacy, succumbed to her escalating suspicions, the revelation of text messages from a mysterious Vanessa shattered the illusion of contentment, exposing a year-long affair that had unfolded in the shadows, as Iris delved into the incriminating messages, her emotions swirled into a storm of anger and confusion, the man she had seen as a victim of war now stood accused of infidelity, concealing her. Discovery, Iris grappled with the internal turmoil, deciding to gather more evidence before confronting Dave, her mind a battleground between love and betrayal in the days that followed, Iris meticulously pieced together the puzzle, unraveling further details that challenged her perception of Dave, the intricate web of deceit she uncovered heightened the stakes, intensifying the impending confrontation that would redefine the trajectory of their relationship, the love that had once anchored. Their connection now faced the reckoning of undeniable evidence. Amidst the emotional tumult, Iris found herself assisting Dave into bed one evening, an intimate ritual that had become a source of solace, however, the routine took an unexpected turn when a faint perfume, unmistakably a woman's fragrance, lingered in the air, this new discovery became a crucial piece in the puzzle, fanning the flames of suspicion that had already engulfed Iris's heart. The internal struggle between loyalty and evidence reached a tipping point, and Iris stood at the precipice of a life-altering decision, the trust she had invested in Dave, the sacrifices made for his well-being, now seemed like a fragile tapestry unraveling in the face of betrayal, the impending confrontation loomed, and Iris grappled with the emotional turmoil, uncertain of the path she was about to tread, Dave, generally an independent man, had been the center of Iris's universe, their relationship. Forged in the crucible of war and disability, faced an unforeseen challenge that would test them. Strength of their bond, the woman who had once seen Dave as a symbol of resilience now confronted the possibility of shattered trust and the complex aftermath that awaited as the days unfolded, Iris found herself on a quest for truth, uncovering the layers of deception that had woven themselves into the fabric of her marriage, the scent of betrayal lingered in the air and the impending confrontation hung over their shared space like a storm on the horizon, the emotional journey Iris embarked. Upon painted a vivid picture of the complexities inherent in navigating the aftermath of shattered trust, the resilience required to face an uncertain future became a focal point, as Iris grappled with the heart-wrenching decision to confront the man she loved and the emotional turmoil that would follow in its wake, the journey unfolded in unexpected ways, revealing the fragility of love. The resilience of the human spirit, and the transformative power of facing the truth, no matter how painful. It may be, choosing not to delve deeper into the confrontation that night. They retired to bed, attempting to put the incident behind them, however, the unsettling feeling lingered, setting the stage for a revelation that would shatter Iris's world the following evening, Dave casually informed Iris that he was meeting military friends for drinks after dinner, despite his explanation, Iris couldn't shake off the unease, determined to unravel the truth, she decided to discreetly follow him. Little did she know that this decision would lead her down a path to the shocking truth she had feared, following Dave's trail through the city, Iris observed his anxious glances, and after a considerable journey, he arrived at a house, Dave's confident entrance, coupled with a warm greeting from a woman inside, crushed Iris, the woman was unmistakably Vanessa, confirming Iris's worst fears, she had all the proof she needed, and the betrayal cut deep, hurriedly returning home, Iris packed her belongings. Fueled by anger and hurt, when Dave arrived later that night. The house was in disarray, and Iris didn't hold back, 
she declared that she knew about his infidelity, screamed her frustration, and drove off, leaving behind a shattered marriage booking a hotel for a few nights in the city, Iris grappled with the emotional aftermath, she contemplated her next steps, envisioning a future as a single woman, amidst the chaos, thoughts of Vanessa lingered, raising questions about the woman who had played a role in dismantling her marriage, the next day, seeking. Distraction, Iris headed to a shopping mall, ignoring Dave's persistent calls, she immersed herself in the joy of browsing antique shops, however, her quest for normalcy took an unexpected turn when she spotted Dave and Vanessa across the street in a coffee house, they sat by the window, chatting and smiling, then, an unimaginable act occurred, something that defied the limitations imposed by Dave's wheelchair, an act that left Iris questioning everything she thought she knew the shocking revelation that Dave Iris's supposedly disabled husband, could walk on his own sent her world spiraling into a disorienting chaos, struggling to comprehend the implications of this newfound information, Iris grappled with the foundations of their entire relationship, in a voice that resonated with disbelief and hurt, she vocalized her thoughts, questioning the authenticity of everything they had shared, the bustling street around her bore witness to her emotional outburst, yet the cacophony of car engines drowned. Out her distress, leaving Iris isolated in her overwhelming sea of confusion, Dave and the mysterious woman emerged from the coffee shop, their embrace a cruel confirmation of Iris's worst fears, fighting the urge to unleash her emotions, Iris observed from a distance, attempting to make sense of the betrayal unfolding before her eyes, struggling with a cascade of tears, Iris followed them along the sidewalk, the parallel paths symbolizing the emotional distance that had grown between her and the man she thought she knew, despite her yearning to eavesdrop on their conversation, crossing the street became a tumultuous endeavor, traffic conspired against her, presenting obstacles at every turn, the universe seemed to toy with Iris, thwarting her attempts to gain proximity, when she finally crossed the busy intersection, Dave and the woman were already distant figures in a parking lot, getting into a car, presumably Vanessa's, as they drove away, Iris felt the weight of defeat and resignation, her efforts to confront them or understand the situation in real time proved futile, returning to her hotel, she sank onto the bed, her head pounding as she attempted to piece together the timeline of Dave's betrayal, recalling the texts she had discovered on his phone, Iris swiftly connected the dots, realizing that Dave had been acting strangely for almost a year. The depth of the deception left her grappling with a tumult of emotions in the solitude of her hotel room, Iris. Confronted the fragments of her shattered marriage. She revisited the memories, trying to discern the moments when the facade began to crumble, how many times had Dave deceived her, feigning his physical limitations to create a false narrative, the weight of the lies pressed on her chest, making it difficult to breathe, over the next few days, Iris grappled with the aftermath of the revelation, she confronted the stark reality of a marriage built on deceit, betrayal, and an unsettling realization of her own vulnerability, the emotional, Roller coaster swung between anger, sorrow, and disbelief, each emotion left its mark on her, creating a mosaic of pain that seemed insurmountable, Iris sought solace in the city's vastness, wandering through its streets like a lost soul, the urban landscape mirrored her internal chaos, the towering buildings reflecting the shattered fragments of her trust, the once familiar places now felt alien, echoing the profound disconnection she experienced with the person she thought she knew best as the days passed, Iris found herself at a crossroads, the path forward seemed uncertain, shrouded in the mist of betrayal, the city, with its bustling streets and indifferent crowds, became both a sanctuary and a reminder of the profound loneliness she now faced, the city's heartbeat pulsated with a rhythm that mocked her disrupted life, pushing her to confront the unsettling truth about the person she had shared her world with. In moments of solitude, Iris pondered the intricacies of trust and the Fragility of human connections, the scars left by Dave's deception ran deep, questioning the foundation of every relationship she had ever known, the echoes of her emotional outburst on that bustling street reverberated in her mind, a testament to the raw vulnerability she had unwillingly unveiled amidst the turmoil, Iris began to rebuild herself, the hotel room transformed into a cocoon of self-discovery, where she faced the pain head-on, determined to emerge stronger, the city, once a witness to her unraveling, became a backdrop for her resilience, with each step, Iris moved towards healing, 
leaving behind the debris of a broken marriage and embracing the uncertain but empowering journey ahead, rage replaced the initial sadness as Iris processed the extent of the lies and manipulation. Anger surged through her veins as she considered the years of dedicated care she had poured into their relationship. Deceived by a husband who feigned disability for his own deceitful purposes, determined to sever ties. Iris made a decisive move that same day, calling a lawyer, she initiated the process of divorce, eager to liberate herself from the clutches of a destructive relationship built on betrayal relocating to her mother's house, Iris sought refuge and support during this challenging period, the familiarity of home provided solace, and her mother, shocked by the revelations, empathized with her daughter's plight. In the midst of this familial embrace, Iris unfolded the divorce papers on the living room table, a symbolic act of reclaiming control over her life, trembling hands signed the dotted line, marking the definitive end to a chapter tainted by deceit and heartbreak, Iris stood resolute, choosing herself in the face of betrayal, determined to move forward into a future untethered from the lies that had bound her for far too long. The momentous decision to confront Dave for the final signature on the divorce papers loomed over Iris like a storm cloud, the prospect of facing him again. Was daunting, but she believed that obtaining his signature would bring closure to a tumultuous chapter of her life, little did she know, a surprising revelation awaited her, one that would reshape her perspective in ways she never anticipated, intent on driving to Dave's place, Iris requested the car keys from her mother, ready to face the inevitable confrontation, however, destiny had other plans, and an unforeseen surprise was lurking behind her mother's front door, unbeknownst to Iris, a Revelation awaited her that would alter the course of her life. With divorce papers in hand, Iris bid farewell to her mother, mustering the strength to embark on this final leg of her emotional journey, convincing herself once more that she was making the right decision, she approached her car, parked in front of the house, ready to confront Dave and put an end to their tumultuous relationship as she twisted the doorknob and opened the door with a determination to sever ties. Iris couldn't have predicted what awaited her just beyond the threshold, however. The moment she stepped into view, her world ground to a sudden halt, it took ten seconds for her first footstep to land on the ground, as the shocking sight outside her mother's house paralyzed her to her astonishment, there stood Dave, his tears betraying the gravity of the situation, the wheelchair, a constant presence in their lives, was conspicuously absent, the man she thought she knew, disabled by war, now stood on both feet, taller than Iris herself, the surreal image stirred a maelstrom of emotions within her, leaving Iris grappling with the enormity of this unexpected twist a deafening silence enveloped them, broken only by the hitched breaths escaping Iris's lips, Dave, vulnerable and exposed, attempted to speak, but the words caught in his throat, Iris, still holding the divorce papers, stared at him with a mixture of disbelief and confusion. The foundations of her reality crumbled as she tried to reconcile the image of the disabled veteran with the man standing before her. As the initial shock began to ebb, Iris found her voice, demanding an explanation for the years of deception, Dave, tears streaming down his face, recounted a harrowing tale of fear, shame, and the desperation to keep Iris by his side, he spoke of the burden of his perceived disability, the weight of the lies that grew heavier with each passing day in the midst of this revelation, Iris grappled with conflicting emotions. The anger that had fueled her determination to divorce transformed into a complex mix of sympathy, empathy, and lingering resentment. She listened to Dave's confession, struggling to comprehend the lengths he had gone to maintain the facade that ultimately shattered their marriage. The air hung heavy with the weight of their shared history, and as the truth unfolded, Iris faced a crossroads, the divorce papers, once held with firm resolve, now felt like fragile remnants of a shattered reality. The choice to proceed with the divorce or to navigate the complexities of forgiveness lay before her. A decision that would shape the trajectory of her life in unexpected ways, the surreal encounter outside her mother's house left Iris with a daunting question, could she find it within herself to forgive and rebuild, or would she continue down the path of severing ties, forever changed by the revelations that had unfolded before her, in his hands, Dave held a bouquet of flowers, an offering that seemed incongruent with the shattered reality Iris had believed in, with a straight face, Iris uttered her planned farewell, only to be stopped in her tracks as the door swung open to reveal a truth she could never have fathomed, Dave's tearful eyes met hers, 
and he began to speak, his words slowly unraveling a narrative that defied all expectations, Iris, on the verge of anger and disbelief, listened as Dave explained that Vanessa, the woman she assumed to be his mistress, was, in fact, his physical therapist. Over the past year, she had been assisting him on a remarkable journey, the arduous process of learning to walk again, Dave pointed at his legs, a tangible representation of the dedication and effort that had eventually borne fruit, Iris stood in silence, absorbing the unexpected revelation, Dave continued to recount the story she thought she knew, highlighting that after the wartime accident, doctors had declared he would never walk again, however, a glimmer of hope emerged over a year ago when Dave started to feel a subtle sensation in his big toe, a sensation deemed impossible by medical professionals. Tears streamed down Iris's face as she struggled to reconcile the conflicting emotions within her, the anger that fueled her actions began to waver, replaced by a profound sense of disbelief and astonishment, Dave's confession shattered the narrative Iris had constructed, leaving her to grapple with the realization that her assumptions were far from the truth, as the unexpected revelation settled. Iris reluctantly agreed to hear the entirety of Dave's explanation, understanding that the path to forgiveness and understanding was paved with unforeseen twists and turns, Dave's eyes glistened with tears as he continued his story, interpreting the emotional display as a sign from the universe, an indication that he could shape his destiny, his journey toward reclaiming mobility unfolded as a testament to perseverance and determination. Desperate for assistance, Dave reached out to experts across the country, encountering reluctance until he stumbled upon Vanessa, a local physical therapist, who operated mainly from her home, Vanessa, Unlike the corporate therapists Dave had approached earlier, agreed to take him on as a client despite the bleak prognosis, recognizing the possibility of failure, Dave chose to keep Iris in the dark, the secrecy stemmed from a genuine desire not to raise false hopes and, ultimately, to surprise her with the triumphant news of his recovery, unbeknownst to Iris. Dave attended therapy sessions alone, hiding the truth and weaving a web of deception in, Hopes of presenting her with an unexpected surprise, the revelation that Vanessa wasn't a clandestine lover but Dave's dedicated physical therapist began to reshape the narrative, with trembling hands, Dave held out a bouquet of flowers as a symbol of sincerity and apology, Iris, emotionally overwhelmed and questioning her own sixth sense, dropped the divorce paper she had carried with her. In an unexpected turn of events, she found herself believing every word that spilled from Dave's tearful confession. Acknowledging the depth of Iris's pain, Dave expressed his regret and promised transparency going forward, Iris, swayed by the authenticity of his words, threw herself into his arms, tears flowing freely, the couple kissed and embraced for an extended period, their shared history of love and hardship now converging into a moment of reconciliation, expressing her love and remorse for doubting Dave's intentions. Iris embraced the renewed connection with her husband, in the aftermath of the emotional storm, Dave unveiled another surprise, he revealed his intention to remarry Iris, a proposition steeped in love and devoid of the burden of his disability, in a carefully planned gesture, Dave dropped to one knee, presenting Iris with a ring symbolizing a fresh start, overwhelmed with joy, Iris accepted the proposal, and the couple embarked on a journey to rebuild their lives together. The unexpected turn of events had spared them from a divorce, and they now found themselves planning. A wedding just two months later, the wedding was an intimate affair, a celebration of love surrounded by close friends and family, even Vanessa, who had played a pivotal role in Dave's recovery, attended the ceremony as a testament to their gratitude, Iris and Vanessa, despite the initial misunderstandings, became good friends, united by their shared connection to Dave's journey. The couple exchanged vows that reflected their newfound equality, free from the constraints of caretaking and disability. The ceremony marked a fresh beginning for Dave and Iris, a union built on love, honesty, and the promise of a healthy future, their lives unfolded in happiness, free from the physical and mental burdens that had plagued them before, while Dave occasionally felt reminders of his injury, the couple faced the challenges hand in hand, determined to embrace the sunlit path ahead, their love story had come full circle, reaffirming that together, they could conquer any obstacle life. Presented, thanks for watching until the end. Don't forget to subscribe and give us a thumbs up so you won't miss any of our next videos.